Hello everyone, this is Live Live here at Oak Park Apartments. Um, we have four or five calls and uh, so many text messages saying that it was a crime scene here at Oak Park Apartments. I just arrived and the medical examiner did just leave. So if you familiar with this area, Oak Park Apartments, um, I'm in the back part. I'm not in the front, I'm in the back part. So if you know anyone that live in these, these uh, Oak Park Apartments, uh, please call and check on your family. The medical examiner just left. Um, once again, the condolence goes out to the family. We had several calls and several reports of um, yellow tape along with uh, medical examiner. Once again, the condolence goes out to the family. Right now, um, Oak Park Apartments, that is behind the snooks, the back part. So if you're familiar with this area, you know, anyone that live in this neighborhood, please call and check on your family member. When I arrived, the medical examiner did just leave. I don't know if it's a male or a female, but if you're familiar with this, um, this part of Oak Park Apartments in the back of Snooks, it'd be good if you guys call and check on your family. I don't have uh, much details on, but uh, we have several, uh, several calls and several reports of, you know, yellow tape along with um, homicide detectives. So if you're familiar with this area, it's the, not the front part of Oak Park Apartments. If you're familiar with Oak Park Apartments, it's in the back, like behind Snooks. Once again, um, on the behalf of Real STL News, you guys have our condolences. We don't know if it's a male or a female, but Homicide Detectives is in the back. They don't have no yellow tape or anything like that. They're trying to keep it on a hush-hush. But we got several calls and several reports of um, a possible... Um, oh, shit, deceased. We don't know if it's a male or a female. But when I arrived, I did ride past the medical examiner. We do have homicide detectives. This is uh, North County, St. Louis, right off 270 in Bell Fountain, Oak Park Apartments. Yes, yeah, the old Sierra Vista. Once again, you don't see yellow tape. They're trying to keep it on a hush hush. But homicide detectives, along with the uh, crime scene, they're on the other side. When I um, arrived, I was riding past the medical examiner. So once again, on the behalf of Real STL News, you know, the family, you guys in my prayers. I'm not in front of Oak Park Apartments. I'm in the back of it. It's like right behind Snooks. If you're familiar with Oak Parks, it's like two parts to get in. They got the front part and they got the back part. The front part is like right on uh, Bell Fountain. I'm not in that area. I'm in the back part, like behind Snooks. So if you're familiar with the where I'm at, it'd be good if you guys call and check on your family members. We don't know if it's a male. We don't know if it's a female. We just got word of um, heavy police present, along with yellow tape, along with um, homicide detectives. Once again, we don't know if it's a male or a female, but if you have any family members that live in Oak Park Apartments in the backside, it would be good if you guys call and check on them. And if you notice, uh, Oak Park been having a lot of things happening. This is the same uh, apartments where the cops killed a young man a couple of months ago. So if you're watching this, show this for the awareness. I haven't talked to a sergeant or a lieutenant or anything like that. The information I do have is from the um, people that live in the complex. Once again, if you show this for the awareness, gladly appreciate it. I don't have too much information on uh, what's going on right here, but I did ride past the um, medical examining truck, so uh, it is a, uh, it don't look good. Once again, a thousand prayers goes out to the family.
Once again, my location is Oak Park Apartments. Um, I know you guys used to seeing yellow tape. I'm guessing they're trying to keep it on the hush hush. But when I arrived, I rolled past the uh, medical examiner. And uh, normally when they comes out, when they come out, it's, it's, it, does, it doesn't look good. So if you're familiar with these apartments, it's behind Snooks, the back part. It'd be good if you guys call and check on your family. Um, I haven't talked to a sergeant or a lieutenant or anything like that. But homicide detectives is on the scene. This is North County, right off Bell Found in 270. So you have any family member that lives in the back of uh, Oak Park Apartments, it'd be good if you guys call and check on your family. I don't have much details on what's going on, but normally when the medical examiner and homicide detectives on the scene, it doesn't look good. Once again, on the behalf of Real STL News, the thoughts and prayers is uh, praying for the family and friends and anyone that's affected by this um, tragedy. Once again, I know you guys used to seeing yellow tape. Um, they having this on the hush hush. And as you know, um, Oak Park Apartments been having a lot of uh, a lot of things going on in Oak Park Apartments. This they trying to keep it on the hush hush. But if you have any family that lives behind um, Oak Park Apartments, it'd be good if you guys call and check on your family. When I arrived, I did ride past the uh, medical examiner along with um, homicide detectives. We got the call like uh, almost an hour ago. So this, this scene is very uh, old. And um, normally you'll see yellow tape, but there is no yellow tape out. One last recap, give me a second. Thank you guys for tuning in to Real STL News. This slide live here at Oak Park Apartments where we got uh, several calls and several reports of uh, heavy police present. When I arrived, um, I rode past the uh, medical examiner. Normally when they come out, it, it's never a good look, along with uh, homicide detectives. We don't know uh, if it was a male or a female. We don't know if it's multiple people. We don't have that as of right now. I haven't spoke to a sergeant or a lieutenant or anything in that nature. But normally when um, homicide detectives along with medical examiner is out, it doesn't look good. I know you guys used to seeing yellow tape. They're trying to keep this on the hush-hush. But, um, yeah, we got several calls and several reports of the medical examiner being out here. And when I arrived, by us being out here so much, we can recognize the homicide detectives. Once again, I'm right behind... Um, the Snooks. I'm not in the front of, uh, front side of Oak Park Apartments. I'm behind the Oak um, Snooks. So if you know anyone that lives behind Oak Park Apartments, please call and check on your family. We don't know how many people, um, I'm not going to say deceased because I'm not going to put no false information, but normally when you see homicide detectives along with the medical examiner, it doesn't look good. So if you guys watching this, please share this for the awareness. And once again, on the behalf of Real STL News, you guys have my uh, condolences. And if you guys notice, Oak Park Apartments right off 270 and Bell Fountain have been having a lot of activity lately.
So once again, uh, on the behalf of Real STL News, you guys have my prayers. Once again, we do this for the community because we are the community. Everybody be safe.